right guys, I thought I'd just give you another quick update on how the uh, Titan's coming along. Um, with a few hours spent on it, but to be honest, it doesn't look like I'm actually making a dent on it. But believe me, guys, a lot of work involved in this one. Um, I'm not sure if you can actually tell if it's anything different from the last video, but I have done an awful lot of stuff. Um, I've opted for actually bringing up this uh, bronze colour a little bit more. I muted it too much before, in my opinion. And um, so I've not actually weathered it, it's more just had the wash on top of it, and I think it actually looks better for it now. So, quite pleased with that. Done a lot of work on the head. You can see the eye in there just about. Um, but I've mainly been working on the top section uh, and on all, and all of these like little details like all these skulls and bodies and so forth. Some of the wash is a little bit wet still so it might uh, look like it's shiny. Uh, I've been working on the wood. There's a lot of shields and things embedded in the shoulder plates of this Titan and so forth. Uh, the missile pod on the top as well. There's just masses of detail everywhere really, so it's an extremely time consuming job of picking it all out as I'm going along. I'm just basically moving the camera over it so you can just get an idea of what it looks like. The um, metal work parts on it alone are quite extensive because they're very awkward to reach in all sorts of strange odd places. It's a real pig to get the brush in there, but it's coming on. I know it's slow, but everything comes to he who waits. Um, hopefully it'll look all right when it's complete. But I've got to say, it's it's a really difficult thing to paint. It, I'm struggling with what colours to try and use. I mean, I've used that many different browns and greens and things on it. One of the biggest problems is, 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 the, is the flesh and the corpses and so forth. Now obviously skeletons um, won't be too difficult, you know, bleach bone and so forth. But the rotting flesh uh, colour is very similar to the bleach bone colour. And believe me, there are lots of areas of rotting flesh on it. I'm opting for that really, mainly with the um, corpses that aren't fully decomposed. So what I'm going to have to do is sort of like, once the wash has gone off, I'll have to go back over it. To, uh, maybe probably with dry brushing could probably be the most effective way of dealing with it. And um, doing that way, yeah. So I'm, I'm just rambling on, talking nonsense now. But there it is, guys. As you can see, it's coming on slowly, very slowly. Nonetheless, it's getting done. Not a bad looking model. I've done the eyepiece in there as well, it's very dark at the moment. Oh there you go, you can see it a little bit better now. So yeah, I think the bronze is definitely, uh, I think it's dwarf bronze I'm using. Uh, and the tones that I've used, yeah, I'm keeping it at that because I think it looks better. It just looked too green before, so. There you go guys, a little update. So don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. And of course I will see you in the next one.